I've, yes, I've, I've got a follow-up question, which is, um, what about the sort of less tangible benefits uh, to, to companies um, that, uh, you know, and to what extent can you measure this? Um, I mean, is it easier to, to hire the best people in the market when you have those kind of values? And, and is that something you measure, and is that something that's really tangible beneficial? Well, like, uh, it's, it's, I agree, it's difficult to measure okay. that. Like, uh, I don't want to work on this. If we're hiring somebody, the first thing that we telling the person is like, these are the values. Okay, this is this is uh, this is how we this is how we operate, and we onboarding process. Onboarding process. We show them the company. We show them the the the, um, the open space, like no no offices. This is how we this is how we operate. And there is like a certain number of people which will say no, like this is not for me. Like I don't I don't like that. Like I uh, I don't want to work on this in this company. And then uh, obviously we have a we we have a special hiring process uh, where, like, I, I wouldn't compare it as to Google because in Google you have to go through five to, I don't know, eight interviews, like, so they make sure that you are the right person, but, like, I would say the number of interviews would be around five and there would be also people from your uh, potential team actually talking to you um, uh, and so you, so not that they make a decision, but they, they, they have a comment. In, uh, or to like uh, who they feel is, is, uh, is, is better. So, but it's 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 a it's a rigorous uh, hiring process. <coughs> I'll have to get the best people. Thank you so much, uh, Monica.